I've sat down and filmed a video it's so surreal being back in this spot and filming again I'm really sorry I've been super busy just with my social life school life and going into second year of sick form and everything but I am back now Hooray! and I thank you guys so much for sticking with me even though I've not uploaded in like a month it is crazy but yeah today I have a massive collective haul to show you I've got things from here there and everywhere literally I must have collected these like over two months, three months, because I haven't done a haul video in what feels like forever. So I've got a lot to show you, um, a lot of clothing, makeup, shoes, and bits and bobs. So I hope you like to see this video and let's get started. So because I've collected this over time, I haven't got it in like set bags because obviously I've unpacked it all and I've used some of this stuff. So I'm just gonna do it in sections. So I'm gonna do clothing first. I'm gonna say how much I think it was and where it was from. So, the first item I have is from Primark. It is this long sleeved, stripy, basic t shirt. Um, and it was, I think it was like four pounds maybe, between four and six pounds. And it's just stripy, long sleeved, quite thin. I had to get it in like two sizes up. Um, this is a size 14 because it was really short in the body or it would be too short in the arms. And yeah, I haven't figured out how I'm going to style this one yet. But I really liked it and I think stripes are my thing at the moment so I got that one. Also from Primark I kind of got this top which is, I don't know how to describe the style of it really, kind of a turtleneck, kind of not. Um, I've got one of these in the opposite colour so mostly white with black stripes so I thought I'd get the one which is black with white stripes and I got this one in a size 14 and I wish I got the other one I have in a size 14 because it's such a better fit. It's a really nice tight material and it gives you a really nice figure. I think this was again about £4 and I love it so much. Also from Primark, they're all inside out which is very annoying. Um, I have this grey kind of vest top. I think it's kind of a high neck, would you say that's a high neck? It's a high neck with these little straps. The annoying thing is though you can't really wear a bra with it because it looks funny with the straps. Um, and then at the back it just has this open little hole thing and again this gives you a nice figure but I wish I got it in the size up now because it is a bit short in the body but I really love the colour grey so I couldn't go wrong with that one again I think it was £4 again from Primark these are all different like times that I went this is like one of my favourite purchases I've ever got from Primark ever 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 the colour khaki green I absolutely love it and I was determined to get some khaki coloured green stuff for this autumn so I've got this long sleeved with a kind of high neck, it's just khaki and it's got lines down it, it's stretchy, it's kind of thicker than a t-shirt, it's kind of like a jumper. This was £6 because I remember I brought this recently. Got it in a size 10, I absolutely love this, I'm going to do an outfit of the day or an autumn get ready with me video with this in it because I absolutely love it and I styled it the other day and oh my gosh I'm in love with it. Next thing is not from Primark, it is some jeans. Now, if you know me, I'm a leggings person, I would, I would, I would never ever, ever buy jeans, but my dad took me into Next and I tried on these jeans and they're actually called legging, not even leggings, they're just called legging, stretchy material, and they're 18 pounds each, but they are so comfortable. I've got them in this blue color and I kind of roll up the ends like this. So I've got this blue color, the pockets on the front aren't real, but then there is, it's on the back as well and I love those they're so comfortable that I even had to get them in a different color I got them in um, this kind of faded black grey color because I don't know it just reminded me of the Topshop Joni jeans and I absolutely love them they're so comfortable and they're really 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 good fit next item of clothing is from select I've got something in my eye this is again another khaki colored jumper it's slightly cropped and I'm in love with this so so much I roll up the sleeves but I'm just gonna unroll them for you so you can see it I never bought anything from select before this was 10.99 and I absolutely am in love with it khaki colored stripes down it long sleeved it's kind of like a darker green I suppose but I absolutely love this next I have some pajamas I don't know if that classes as clothing I guess it does 
when I saw these in Primark, I could not resist. They were £8. Minion pyjama bottoms. You cannot go wrong. In this haul, you're going to see a lot of Minion things because I've only recently gone to see the Minion film. I haven't even seen Despicable Me, but my boyfriend dragged me along to see Minion. I did want to go and see it, but... And I'm obsessed with them now. It just has these, like, quirky little sayings on, um, like, Minions, Bello, and then little letters that spell out Minions, and then... They have bananas and minions on it and they're just neon colours and I love it so much so I had to get those and they're just cuffed at the end as well which I really like that. And then one of my favourite things I've got pyjama wise, if I can reach it, I think this is not going to do it justice. I might insert a picture somewhere or if you go on my Instagram you'll see it. Everyone thinks this is a onesie but it is a kind of short version of a dressing gown. It's a little giraffe. Look at that how cute that is and it's got the little main thing and the pattern it's so cozy this was 10 pounds but i hate the ones that drag all the way down your bum because it's easier just to do stuff in so i find this more cozy i'm gonna move on to some gifts that i got from christian when he came back from america he went to america and i asked him to get me some stuff um, and he did very kindly um surprise like i didn't know about this one as a surprise he got me this little minion and it's so cute it's a caveman minion and he got this to match my other minion which you will see in a minute and it's a little like statue of a minion and i love it so much and i'm very grateful for it i don't know how much it was but it's from america so he also got me a lot of american sweets and we were going to do the american candy video but kind of ate all the sweets so yeah but i still have some left um i did not eat these personally because i hate them <laughs> i gave these to my dad he got me the peanut m ms um i haven't tried these yet he got me the red vines original twists um, he got me some icebreakers in wintergreen we tried these and we were like <gasps> it was like burning our throat but they just Quite cute actually just popping your bag um, he also got me some chocolate M&Ms some Mike and Ike's which we have recently repurchased because they are literally addictive um, a jaw breaker oh it's here I've started on that one he got me a jaw breaker uh, what else did he get me picture on my Instagram of all the sweets that we got but I can't remember off the top of my head but I'm so grateful thank you Christian for getting me those gifts moving on to makeup now I don't know what it was but um Rim, no, Maybelline and Rimmel had like some offers on, so I took the opportunity and I brought some makeup. So, the first thing I got, it was two for ten pounds in Maybelline, was the Superstay Better Skin Foundation. Now, I thought I'd try this out because it says that it leaves you like obviously fully covered and even toned skin and stuff like that, but then it also says on the back that you can have better skin in three weeks, so it actually helps improve your skin in some way in 010 ivory so that is what it looks like and also in that offer i decided to get the baby skin instant pore razor because i've never tried it before and it looks so cute and i know a lot of people use it i'm not sure if i'm too keen on it though it's a really weird consistency it's like a gel but i guess i have to play around with it a little bit more then i just repurchased from rimmel um the wake me up concealer because i'm obsessed with this and i ran out of it so quickly before um this is good for just like days when you just don't want to wear foundation you just want to cover up a bit and then yeah uh, mine is in 010 ivory <laughs> they have the same color isn't that interesting um, and this was five pounds alone. Now, in like no particular order, I've got some random bits that I purchased. First thing is from Primark. It is a candle. You know how obsessed I am with candles, hence all these candles here. This one looks so cute. It's in a jar. You cannot go wrong. It was three pounds. Still got the price on it. It is in light soda lime. This is such a refreshing scent for summer, but I'm keeping those summer vibes. I'm not even kidding. If you're going to Primark, please smell this because so fresh another random thing is that when me and christian went to brighton um, we went on the pier and we went in the arcade and we collected loads of tickets so we could both get a little minion each now i did have a little key ring on it but somehow it's gone missing and I, I don't know where it's gone but me and christian have the same little minion and when we go places where we can't be together like when he went to america he was supposed to take his minion but he forgot 
but <laughs> normally we take it everywhere with us when we go somewhere. And it's just a little like cute little thing that we have. And look at him, he's just so adorable. I want a minion! I love him so much. And this is to match the caveman. You see, Christian, you are clever. He thought well. And yeah, I got the little caveman minion. And I love him so much. Uh, next random thing that doesn't really fit into any category is I got a new purse. This was six pounds from Primark. I really like it. Gabrielle has like the kind of purpley colour, beige, I don't know. It's kind of like a, I don't know how to call it. But I got this one because a lot of my bags are black and I just liked it because it's sleek. Last random thing is an iPhone case. Look at it. Just look at it go. Look how pretty. Chloe Rain's got one of these and it inspired me to get one. Now, I have brought myself some random piece of jewellery for the sake of it. I got this watch. I don't know if I've ever spoken about this in my videos. I think I've mentioned it in my vlog ones. I don't know. But I never spoke about it. I got this watch from Amazon for £3 because I do not wear watches a lot. And if I do wear it, it's just for fashion purposes. Although I do still use it for telling the time. but. It's not a major thing to me if it's not a Michael Kors watch, if you get what I'm saying. Um, I had to get a few links taken out, but I absolutely love it. I also went to um, Oxford Street shopping with Christian, and some of the stuff is from Oxford Street, which I've showed you already. And we went into the Claire's, and their Claire's is like really tiny, and it's like really spaced out, there's barely anything in it. But I spotted this necklace in the sale and I loved it. I thought it's just such a little dainty necklace to wear on top of like grey tops or like, you know, when you're having a dainty day. And it's just this silver infinity sign and I love it so much. I think it was £1 or £1.50. And it's just so cute. I don't know if you can see it. Can you see that? I hope you can. Because I love it. And yeah, the next item of jewellery is my most favourite, 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 literally, okay, so this is a really long story, Christian brought me a Pandora ring ages ago, like, two, three months ago, and I wore it every single day, I loved it so much, I was in such a surprise and shock when he gave it to me, and I was so thankful, and then I lost it, I'm an awful girl. Um, I think it fell off when I was walking to work and I was crying down on the phone to him. He was in America at the time, he couldn't do anything. <laughs> and I was crying down on the phone to my dad. And he was like, it's fine. Christian was like, these things happen. It wasn't your fault. We can get it replaced. So what did he do? He replaced it a couple of weeks ago and I'm so thankful. It's the Princess Tiara ring and I love it so, so much. I wear it all the time apart from when I've had a shower, which is just now, hence why it's in the box. And just to show you guys. But I hope you can see that because it's so gorgeous and I love it so, so much. And I'm so thankful that you brought me another one. I think he just knew how upset I was when I lost it. But thank you, Christian, so, so much. I'm going to make it up to you at Christmas because I've got a few ideas in mind. Now we're on to the last category, which is shoes. And you're probably thinking, thank God she does not shut up. I don't know if I've ever showed these, but a while ago I got some beautiful Nikes. I couldn't remember if I showed them or not, it was that long ago that I made a video. I probably have, I don't know. Um, but I got these Nike Roche ones, a bit dirty, I absolutely love these. Um, I got them in the junior section of JD's, they were £40. Um, if I'm not wearing these, I'm wearing my Chelsea boots, but I love them so much. Um, the grey and the black contrast, I love it, it goes with every outfit, they're so comfortable and I love them. So. I got those. Next pair of shoes is my work ones. I don't know if you'll be interested, but they are some that I could wear with dresses and stuff as well. They're just these little pumps with little bows on them. They're from Deutschmann, you know that Greek one? Yeah, that one. Um, they're really nice. They've kind of got this like little rim around it here in like silk and then the bow. And these were $12.99, I believe. I these from last year. I brought them and I was like so happy with them. Well, I wore them so much that the heel actually caved in, so I had to buy some more. These were £19.99, and they're literally my favourite Chelsea boots I've ever got. Um, I'm not sure whether to get some boots with a bigger heel this year, but I don't know. I think that is everything. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up and leave a comment below of what videos you'd want to see next. 
Also, I'm doing the boyfriend tag very soon in an upcoming video. I've asked you guys on Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter maybe? Yeah, to ask me questions um, that you would like to ask because we're going to do questions that you guys want to know the answers to instead of the actual boyfriend tag. So, um, yeah, I've got quite a few questions already, but if you want to add them, add if you want to add to them, leave your questions for the boyfriend tag down below in the comments and don't forget to subscribe because when we get to 500 I'm going to do a giveaway so yeah. Also don't forget about my vlog channel, it's nearly at 50 subscribers already. It will be linked in the down bar or something, I don't know. But I appreciate you watching this video and I am now back, yay! Okay, I'll see you guys in my next video, bye!